Baradin's Bridge Plato guards a bridge, offering Socrates' passage only for a true statement. Socrates, ever clever, says you'll throw me in. Plato is stuck. If he throws Socrates in, the statement is true, breaking his promise for truth. If he lets him cross, the statement is false, breaking his promise for lies. Either way, Plato seems destined to break his word. This paradox shows the tricky nature of promises and language. Menno's Paradox Menno's Paradox throws a curveball at the very idea of learning. It says you can't search for what you already know, and you can't search for what you don't know. So, how does learning even happen? Fitch's Paradox We can know all the truths, right? But if that's true, shouldn't we already know everything? Fitch's paradox exposes this frustrating contradiction. If all knowledge is attainable, why are there still things we don't know? This challenges the idea of absolute knowledge, suggesting there might be limits to what we can ever truly understand. Goodman's paradox. Emeralds are green, right? So future ones must be too. But what about grew green before 2050, then blue? Goodman's paradox exposes a problem with predictions. Both green and grew fit past emeralds, so how can we be sure what future ones will be? This challenges the idea that past experiences always predict the future. Analysis Paradox The curious watchmaker dismantles their creation to understand it, but the paradox unfolds. To truly see how the watch works, they must break it, yet a broken watch reveals no secrets. This struggle reflects the challenge of analysis, understanding something complex, sometimes requires taking it apart, but that can destroy the very mechanism we seek to understand. Free Will Paradox If God knows all our choices, can we truly be free? The paradox of free will exposes this clash. Knowing the future seems to erase our ability to choose, yet without free will, are we responsible for our actions? This paradox challenges both free will and all-knowingness, leaving us to ponder, can we have both, or is choice itself a deeper mystery? Liberal Paradox Absolute freedom, the very essence of liberty, seems to paradoxically require limitations. Imagine a society with no restrictions, wouldn't one person's freedom to party infringe on another's right to quiet study? This paradox exposes a core tension, Unfettered freedom seems self-defeating, requiring limitations for social harmony. Can true freedom exist without boundaries, or is it forever out of reach? White horse is not a horse. The white horse is not a horse paradox challenges our understanding of classification. While white describes a color and horse identifies a specific animal, the paradox argues that these distinct concepts somehow prevent a white horse from being solely a horse, in essence, it suggests that adding a descriptive detail like white somehow alters the fundamental category of horse, creating a seemingly illogical situation. Zeno's Paradox This throws a wrench into our idea of a simple trip. Imagine walking from home point A to the park point B. The paradox argues it's impossible. Here's the twist. To reach the park, you must first walk half the distance. But then, to reach that halfway point, you need to walk half again, and so on forever. This constant halving of the distance supposedly creates an endless journey where you keep getting closer to the park but never truly arrive. This challenges our understanding of movement and infinity. Can you ever reach your destination if the journey can be broken down into infinitely smaller steps? Omnipotence Paradox The Omnipotence Paradox explores this seemingly contradictory idea. If a being is truly omnipotent, having no limitations, could it create something that defies its own omnipotence, like a stone he couldn't lift? This paradox highlights the logical contradiction inherent in defining absolute power and its limitations. Nihilism Paradox Nihilism and the Paradox of Absurdity The vast and seemingly random universe offers no inherent meaning, according to nihilism. Yet, some argue that recognizing this absurdity can be liberating and lead to a more authentic way of living. The paradox lies in the tension between embracing the meaninglessness and forging a path forward within it. Newcomb's Paradox In a dying world, 
Two alien chambers appear, each identical and radiating an unknown energy. One whispers of unimaginable wealth, the other of guaranteed survival. But there's a terrifying twist. An all-knowing being, somehow connected to these chambers, knows your choice beforehand. A booming voice even erupts from the chambers, revealing they know which one you'll pick. This discovery splits society. Will they play it safe or defy a fate seemingly predetermined? A mind-bending paradox becomes a terrifying reality. Polynesian Paradox Can we know more than we can express? Polynesian Paradox captures the seemingly contradictory idea that humans possess knowledge beyond what we can articulate. We can intuitively perform tasks and make judgments, yet struggle to explain the how and why behind them. Our brains, in a sense, know more than our words can express. This paradox highlights the limitations of language in capturing the full extent of human understanding. Rule Following Paradox The Rule Following Paradox presents a seemingly impossible situation. While rules are intended to be clear-cut guides for our actions, the paradox argues that any action, regardless of its nature, can ultimately be interpreted as following the rule. In essence, the paradox suggests that the very clarity of a rule can be its downfall, creating ambiguity and undermining its ability to definitively determine a course of action. Hedonism Paradox The paradox of hedonism throws a curveball at our pursuit of happiness. While we might chase joy directly, the paradox argues this very pursuit can backfire, making us less happy. Instead, True happiness, it suggests, arises as a byproduct of focusing on other goals and activities we find fulfilling. This seemingly contradictory situation forces us to question how we approach happiness. Can we truly control it, or does it come from focusing on things that bring us joy indirectly? Parfit's Paradox Imagine a happy village V's, a massive city with everyone just okay. The mere addition paradox asks is a bigger population even if less happy, better than a smaller, truly happy one? Do we value quantity of life or quality? This paradox forces us to consider if adding lives always improves things, or if there's a point where it diminishes overall happiness. It's a head-scratcher. Fiction Paradox We cry for fictional characters, cheer for invented heroes, all while knowing they're not real. This paradox of fiction highlights the power of stories to evoke genuine emotions for things we know are made up. It makes us wonder why we care so much about characters who don't exist. Preface Paradox An author meticulously crafts a book, striving for absolute accuracy in every sentence. Yet, in the preface, they acknowledge the possibility that some hidden error may lurk within. This seemingly impossible situation captures the essence of the preface paradox.